You're never going to think your way into positive thought. You're always going to act your way into positive thought. And that is a very alpha way of describing it, a very masculine way of describing it, because I believe that the essence of being a man is action. It's not about who you are at heart. It's about what your actions say about you. Because your intentions mean nothing if you don't actually act on them. I do believe we are rational creatures. If you've ever read Marcus Aurelius' Meditation, you will know what I'm talking about. We operate as a unit. My purpose is to advance your purpose. Your purpose is to advance everybody else's purpose. So we are social creatures and ultimately you do have the ability to determine what affects you. Just because something, somebody says something to you does not mean you have to let that affect you. Just because something horrible happens to you doesn't mean you have to perceive it like that. Everything in this world is based on our perceptions. And our perceptions are based on how we, how we choose to view the world. Because it is a choice. Everything is a choice. But it is extremely hard when you are in a negative frame of mind because we all get negative frames of mind throughout the day. That's bound to happen unless you are fucking perfect. You are bound to experience both positive and negative swings throughout the day. The negative swings in which you start thinking about your life and everything that is going wrong with it. But the thing about it is most of us define ourselves by those negative swings. We start looking at our lives when our mindset goes negative. And some of us are not trained to be able to recognize that. Others are, but just don't obey that judgment. So when our mindset goes negative, we start looking internally and we start looking at all our problems. And then as a result, the negatives are so much stronger that we start to define ourselves by the negatives. We start to look at our lives when our mindset goes negative and we start to define ourselves by that. And some people will try and think their way out of that. Affirmations, whatever, whatever. I believe it's always going to come down to action because as a man, you have to prove to yourself that you are really that. You can't think your way into it. You have to prove yourself. And this is, this is a simple fucking concept, but it's something that needs to be heard because not many of us get it. We look at our lives when our mindset goes negative and we start to define ourselves by that. We think our thoughts are us. And we don't realize that we have the choice to manipulate our thoughts about the world and our thoughts about ourselves. But as men, that choice comes through action, right? For years, bro, for years, I completely identified with every single negative thought that I had. I completely identified with every negative thought that I had. 
And that drove me into mental health issues. I think for me, I can't even say that. I feel like sometimes I feel like I'm just somebody who's always pessimistic. I always see the negative in things. When somebody says something positive, I immediately go to negativity. And I, I, call, I call it reality. I call it realism. But I think really what it is, everything is a choice. And if you choose to see the world in a negative way, that is your choice. Because nothing is inherently negative. Nothing is inherently negative. That breakup, that injury, that job that you lost, that pain that you experience, none of it is inherently negative if all of it serves a purpose. Would you call the journey of being an entrepreneur negative? Because there's gonna be a lot of lonely nights, just like the journey to whatever endeavor that you have is going to take a lot of sacrifice. It's going to take a lot of negative thoughts, but it serves a greater purpose. And if something serves a purpose, why would you see it as negative? It's just a means to an end. It's all natural. So when you notice yourself getting into that negative frame of mind, you need to do something to show yourself that you are not negative. You need to go hit a couple sets of burpees. You need to go take a run. You need to go do a workout. Or you need to go give back to somebody. You need to go talk to somebody and no matter how shitty you feel, you gotta put a fucking smile on your face and you gotta try and help them out in one way or the other. And that's going to force you to get out of that negative frame of mind. And at that point, all the answers to the problems that you just contrived in your head will all start to appear to you because you're never gonna find the answers to your life in a negative frame of mind. And this is why I preach fitness so much. because fitness allows you to experience, to, exp to, to take yourself out of that negative frame of mind. And I think the majority of guys are living in negative frames of mind for damn near their entire life. And if they're not working out, I know they are. I think guys just, just have it they just take the easiest route possible. They reduce the amount of friction because they know that they can't deal with the negatives. They know that they can't deal with those, those negative frame, frames of mind that come along with the lonely nights, that come along with the sacrifices. You gotta show yourself that you are what you say you are. You gotta show yourself that there are solutions to the problems that you have. Or maybe you don't even have problems. A lot of our problems are just made up in our own head. A lot of our problems are just made up in our own head. 
Because at the end of the day, all it is is information and decisions. If something is troubling you right now, you have to make a decision. You have to act. And that's it. There doesn't need to be any thought behind it. If it doesn't work out, you it, you made the decision. And you should have faith in that decision. You should have faith in that decision. You should always stick to your word. You should always put your purpose first before everything. Because purpose is what allows you to see through the mirage of negativity in this world. When you hold your purpose close to you, that's what's going to get you through those fucking lonely nights. That's what's going to get you through whatever you're going through right now. There's got to be a purpose at the end of it. But a lot of guys are not living with a purpose. And so they always become trapped in that negative frame of mind. I don't want to see that to happen to anybody. I don't want any of you to go down that rabbit hole of identifying with yourself when you are negative. So my advice to you is after you watch this video, every time you notice those negative thoughts coming up, do something, do something about it, do something positive. And you will realize that fucking quick. Every problem that you imagine in your head is a choice. And they're going to continually come back to you. Those problems are going to continually come back to you. And you know what you're going to do? You're going to continually fucking act on them. And it's that simple. That's the topic for this video. Leave a comment what you thought about this one. Drop a like. Fucking subscribe to the channel.